Hello everyone! Do you have a problem in formulating a research title? If yes, then you're in the right video tutorial. My name is Angelica Silina and our topic is from Chapter 3, Lesson 2, Writing a Research Title. Truly, everyone can make a research title, but only few can make an efficient one. Without further ado, we will start our discussion right now. What do we mean by a research title? Well, in my opinion, research title is an essential part of your research paper. This is where your whole idea and paper evolve. It is important to write an efficient and a specific research title, neither it must not that narrow nor that broad. Another definition says that the research title is a title that summarizes the main idea or ideas of a study. A good title contains the fewest possible words needed to adequately describe the content and or purpose of your research paper. The title of the research is the research problem or inquiry in capsule form. Great care must be taken in the formulation of research title. When you go finally decide on a research topic, make sure that your research topic and research questions match. Let us also pay attention in choosing a topic broad and specific topics. Broad topics will lead you nowhere. In order to narrow down broad topics to specific ones, the purpose or intent of the study must be clear. These are the examples of broad topics. Lack of self-confidence, smoking hazards, human immunodeficiency virus or HIV. And now, we will see the specified equivalent of the three broad topics. The lack of confidence is specified through adding and stating the scope, the roots, the manifestation, and the interventions. The smoking hazards is specified through stating the health hazards of the direct and indirect smoking and in addition of its prevention and cure. The human immunodeficiency virus or HIV is added by its causes, its prevention, and its treatment, and its cure. It is important to specify it because through specifying the topic, you will know your scope and limitations and where you will focus your research project. Techniques in narrowing a topic into a research question. The first one, examine the literature. Published articles are an excellent source of ideas for research questions. They are usually an appropriate level of specificity and suggest research paper. The next one, talk over ideas with others. You may ask people who are knowledgeable about the topic for questions about it that they have thought of. The third one, apply to a specific context. You must focus and narrow the topic on a specific society or geographic unit. You must also consider which subgroups or categories of people, units are involved and whether there are differences among that. The fourth one is to define the aim or desired outcome of the study. Will the study involve applied or basic research? What are the aims of it? So, those are the few techniques for narrowing a topic into our research questions. In writing a research title, always remember the OX, it's double C. O for original, C for clear, another C for concise, and S for specific, so, OX should be applied to create a good research title that reflects your paper. Your research title must clearly reflect the topic of your investigation. So, here are the examples of the title of a specific study both in quantitative and qualitative research. Please do follow me on Twitter at Stambelina, it's triple A and triple E. So this is where our video tutorial ends. Thank you for listening.